Yeah, for the bow tie, we just want to take a um, piece of fondant and I just want to roll it into a uh, rectangle. Put some cornstarch underneath it. Okay, take a pizza cutter, cut down here, up here, across, and down. Now this may be um, wider than we need, but that's okay. We kind of start with this and then we will go from there. Okay, now what we want to do to make the bow tie, um, it's good to use the back of a paintbrush. Pick one end up, take the back of the paintbrush and help that, you, sometimes your fingers get in the way. So if you kind of pick it up with a paintbrush and then curl that underneath, do it on the other side, curl that underneath, slide the tooth, the uh, paintbrush, I should say, out. Other side, same thing, curl that underneath. This side, curl it underneath. And then we want to do it in the middle also. Pick this up, and this time what we would do is we just kind of pinch it in a little bit. Not all the way, we don't want it to be tight, keep it kind of loose. And then in the middle, just kind of squeeze that together. Okay, see how we get the uh, bow tie effect? Now this is obviously too long. So we could take the pizza cutter at this point and cut some of that off. And cut some of that off. And we'll just kind of hold this up and see. That looks pretty good. Okay, now what we're gonna do though before we put it on is we need the center for the bow tie. Okay, so we'll just take this little piece and roll this out. Okay, what I do is flip that over, kind of flip both ends in. Okay, I'm just folding both of the ends in. Flip it back over, take the uh, paintbrush and kind of pop it in the middle and kind of pinch just a little bit in the middle. Okay, and this is gonna be too long so we can pinch some of that off. Just place it right over the center. Still way too long. And then we will lift this up and tuck that around the back. Okay, voila. Okay, now what we need to do is place this on here. So, a little bit of water. Now this is a tricky part because it's that the cake is actually slanted down. I'm gonna have to hold on to this for a few minutes to until like it sticks. And you know what I think I might do here too? Got some royal icing. I'm gonna go ahead and pop a little bit of royal icing there as well. Extra security. It's always a good thing. So what I do when I put this on here, I'm kind of in between um, the pleats is where you want to actually touch, like in here, secure it in there like that. Okay, so I'm just going to leave that toothpick right in there, move on to the uh, clock and just keep an eye on this, and then I'll remove that after it sets a little bit. Yeah.